The golden rule, treat others the way you would want to be treated. Something instilled in most of us since the dawn of time. But studies show that's not necessarily always the case, especially in schools. I've been picked on before in middle school and it's not fun. In that case, let me introduce you to Sid the Goat. He was born with no ears and is completely deaf. Now stick with me, Rock and K Maze is Sid's home, where hundreds of elementary and middle school kids attend field trips every week. So Rock and K Maze is taking advantage of the teaching opportunity that comes along with Sid's special circumstances to teach kids of all ages that it's what's on the inside that counts. It teaches them differences like not to do bullying or to tease somebody because they have a little bit of a disability or something different about them. And it didn't take the kids long at all to identify exactly what was a little bit different about Sid. How is one of the goats different from some of the other ones? Um, because it doesn't have ears. It's not having ears. It has no ear. Um, no holes. But none of them seem to mind the fact that Sid looks slightly different from the other goats. Um, everybody's a little different. Well, fans. Everybody's different. Well, it's just nice to be nice, even though he's not, um, he, even though he's not like you. Donna McGuire teaches special education and said lessons like these are imperative to start teaching kids at a young age. You're still you and you can, and uh, they still have, everybody has feelings and everybody can, can um, get along just great, even if you have some little bit of differences. So Sid, the billy goat, now goes by Sid, the anti-bully goat. Emily Hamilton, Chris 6 News.